We have these giants in South Africa, these giants, these men and women who have given their life to serve us, to this country. And we think about Nelson Mandela, we think about Desmond Tutu, we think about everybody who has dedicated their entire lives to serving others, to pushing forward to make sure that we live in a more equal, more equitable, freer, fairer society. And I don't know about you, but when I think about that, sometimes it feels quite intimidating. Like what, as me, just this small little individual person living in South Africa, how can I actually make a difference? How can I live up to that legacy? And there is this incredible legacy that we have in this country about dedicating time, dedicating resources, dedicating energy into actually making a difference. But it can sometimes feel like quite a lot and quite a lot of pressure as well. How am I going to build on that legacy and how am I going to actually make a difference? But what I want to say to you today is I don't think it needs to be huge. I think the best acts of kindness and the best acts of service are small, consistent efforts. So yes, we have Mandela Day and we'll be talking about that a little bit more later. And yes, it is that one day where we can all be dedicated for 67 minutes to something that is bigger than us. But I'd like to challenge you to bring that into your every day because it's not about the big actions once a year. It's about the small, consistent actions every single day. And so these are two quotes that I found that I thought really resonated with what I'm saying. One from Mother Teresa saying, it's not how much we give, but how much love we put into the giving. And then the other one, which really is what I'm trying to get across today is service doesn't have to be big and grandiose to be meaningful and make a difference. So when we talk about some of these things, what are actually some small consistent efforts that you can do? So donate your old clothing and other items, do a once a season clean out and donate them. Um, we know that we have so many people in need in our communities, in our country, and this is something that is so small It'll make you feel good. You'll have space in your cupboard, but it'll also go a long way to helping others. Pick up and throw away litter. Guys, doesn't cost you anything. Walk down the street, walk outside, pick up some litter. You're helping the environment. Volunteer at an animal shelter. Sign up for a charity, walk or run and get those steps in. Organize a donation for coloring books, toys and art supplies for a kid's ward at a hospital or an ECD center near you or even something as simple as send a message to a friend, letting them know that you appreciate them. These are all really small things that you can do. You can do them once a term, you can do them once a day, you can do them once a month, but they're small, consistent acts of kindness that go a long way to making our country a better place.